Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about Windows 11 24H2 yet again. In this video, we're going to discuss about the Windows 11 24H2 release to RTM, what you need to know, more info, and things like that. So if you enjoy videos like these where we talk about Windows 11 24H2 or other versions of Windows 11, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the Tech Based channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. This video is sponsored by Private Internet Access, a virtual private network where VPN and for shorts hides your IP address and safeguards your internet connection through an encrypted tunnel. Streaming services such as Netflix have different library options based on where you are located. Using private internet access, you will be able to watch those shows or movies that are not available in your current location. Make sure to check out private internet access in the links from the description below for a great deal. 83% discount and 4 months free. For those of you who don't know, Windows 11 24H2 is the next version of Windows 11. Windows 12 was rumored, but Microsoft recently announced that the next version of Windows, respectively Windows 11, will be version 24H2. So on the Canary and Dev channels of the Windows Insider program, where we get testing builds from Microsoft, we have reached the build 26085 for version 24H2, where Microsoft is testing new features that may or may not be released on the final version of Windows 11 24H2. Now, as you may know, Microsoft for quite a while has started to release new features and new Windows 11 versions gradually. So basically, talking about Windows 11 24H2, they released the new platform, which is Germanium. For Windows 11 23H2, it was Nickel, but now the new platform for Windows 11 24H2 is called Germanium. And basically, this is what is going to be released pretty soon in the next month or so to manufacturers. Basically, RTM means release to manufacturers. And if we deep dive into this, basically, Microsoft is releasing this platform and Windows 11 24H2 to certain companies, for example, Samsung, HP, Lenovo, and more, so that they can test out their new devices, create them in accordance to the new Windows 11 version. So basically, those companies will have access to Windows 11 24H2, the core base of it, earlier than normal users so that they can assure the device's compatibility with Windows 11 24H2. And I think that is pretty nice. Also, Zach Bowden from Windows Central talked about this on Twitter. You're going to have a screenshot from one of his tweets in which he's talking about this. I think this is great news because Microsoft, this way, I hope they will release new Windows 11 versions to normal users that are way more compatible, less buggy, and more reliable. Now, also, new features features in Windows 11 24H2 will be released gradually. So in June, maybe July, certain processors and also certain companies will get new features so that they can test them following the September or October release to the general public. And even then, maybe certain users won't have all the new features. So this is what Microsoft does nowadays so that they can assure the compatibility and reliability of the system. I think that is great. But of course, there are also going to be people that say, well, if this new version is released, why am I not getting these new features? But on the other hand, and there are people saying why Microsoft is releasing new features if they are buggy. So Microsoft is trying to fix this complaint issue from users. I think they are doing a pretty decent job. For me, at least, the main versions of Windows that were released on the main release and also on the release preview channel were pretty good. I didn't encounter any bugs, any weird things that stopped me from doing my work. So I think overall, Microsoft is doing a decent job. Now, of course, if you are asking what are the new features that Windows 11 24H2 will have, well, basically, I've made a dedicated video about this. We're going to be able to see that on my channel, Windows 11, a video in which I talked about some of the most important or useful features that will come up in Windows 11. But Microsoft will most likely focus on the AI implementation in Windows. Other than that, a lot of improvements for the taskbar, for File Explorer, and more. But with the time, when we have more info, when we have more testing features from Microsoft, I'm going to make videos in which I'll showcase them to you. And hopefully, users will like the new features that Microsoft is implementing. So basically, these are the things that I wanted to discuss about in this video. Basically, Windows 11 24 is going to be soon released to RTM, to manufacturers. Basically, large companies developing devices, laptops, and more will be able to test the new platform for Windows 11 24H2 and assure the compatibility and reliability of their devices. So for more info, of course, always check out the article below in the video description if you're interested. Don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.